let's say that we have data in BigQuery, we want to visualize this, what should we go for? Just think that Google has two BI tools, Google Core, right, which is a fully fledged enterprise ready solution for BI, focused on exposing everything through APIs, added analytics, LookML with its uh, semantic layer, like a really strong enterprise uh, tool. And then you have the former Data Studio, which is currently Looker Studio, right, which is fast, nimble, easy to use, and also free. We need to fill the gap in between, right, because we do want that, you know, like just two clicks, get my dashboard shared with all my stakeholders, but we also want governance. That's somewhere in between. And this is why you, right now we also have Looker Studio Pro, that Looker Studio Pro brings the enterprise features into the tool that so many teams are already using. I understand currently from my, let's say, business perspective, that uh, these are more or less the same except for the, let's say, the governance part, or how would you uh, look at that uh, angle? I would highlight that the usefulness of a BI tool has is at least twofold, right? First is help my brain understand some complex figures in a visual way, right? Because our brains usually understand the information way better when you see two uh, stacked bars, one next to each other, than when you see a table full of figures. And in here, both Looker Studio and Looker Core are doing it really great. That information is useless if it's not accepted by the majority of the stakeholders from that given domain. Looker Studio is designed to build quick dashboards and that would be shareable within usually small teams, right? You wouldn't use this dashboard to share uh, to share your dashboard with 10,000 users. While Looker Core can also do this, small teams, but can extend beyond a certain threshold, right? So once you build a critical mass of users and of use cases, that's when I would push the button and I would trigger the, the, the testing of Looker Core as well. Uh, is there any uh, like hard limits on when you would say that the team is now large enough to test out Looker or this is something that the teams have to feel for themselves? Once you want to expose the information as embedded analytics, you want to take that information, put it in your app, in your internal apps, etc. You want to look into Looker Core. Right. One of the triggers would be the number of dashboards. If you have more than, I don't know, 200, 300 dashboards, then definitely you need governance. And the second would be the number of users. Usually above 100 users, I would start looking into Looker Core. 